Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole. You can find me on Instagram at Nicole Makes Plans. You can find my website at NicoleMakesPlans.com. Um, today I want to do a weekly plan with me. So if that sounds good, um, let's get started. I do want to do like a flip through of this past week. Um, so this is week 29 in my bullet journal. Um, this is Tombow Color uh, 620. I set up this to do some like future planning, but it ended up like this column was enough for me and I barely even used it. Um, so I think I'm not going to do this again. I'm just going to set up my week like I usually do. This is the dailies. I'm going to leave a couple pages for some like budget planning, spending tracker. If that's interesting to you, definitely comment below and I'll try to film that instead of just doing it by myself. Um, and then just a glance back at the monthly, just to kind of see how that's progressing. I'm using this side to track a photo challenge on Instagram. And then this is my regular monthly. Um, so that is what that's looking like. So we'll all go ahead and hop in and get this started going to begin with um, drawing kind of my lines down the middle of the page. I just find like I don't really need the entire page um, to write out tasks. My tasks are tend to be like pretty short. And this is just a BIC 0.7 number two pencil, mechanical pencil. This ruler is from Westcott. And I like this shorter ruler for the horizontal line since they're a little bit shorter. Um, it might be a scoot. I'm not really sure what this brand is. I think I got it on Amazon. Just going to draw these lines across. Um, I usually leave like a little space at the top to write the week number and then each day of the week has some space. And I've kind of been thinking about doing maybe a different style of weekly, but it's like this one works so well, why would I bother changing it? And another thing, if you've been watching some of my recent videos, I've definitely been hopping in and out of a lot of different planners lately, but I think I really do like this Drum 1917 Bullet Journal version 2 book. So I think I'll stick with this for a while and... Um, Life is getting a little busier, so I don't have as much time to like set up like stuff from scratch at this point. So this is going to be good for now, I think. Um, I work in higher education, so if you either like are in school or work in higher education as well, you know the end of July and August get really wild. Um, so I think that's another reason why I'm like, I'm... I don't want to say I'm burnt out because I love what I do in higher education, but at the same time, like, it's definitely, like, taxing on my energy. Um, so, yeah. And it is week 30, I believe. I'll probably check that in my um, weekly log to make sure. Just using a Tombow N15 for the stamps. I don't really have an ink pad, and, and I tend to find it's like, they tend to be too inky, and then it doesn't really dry very fast, which I kind of need, because I'm pretty impatient. Um, so we are at week 30. And then I've just been doing the first day of the week letter down the side. I'm going to keep doing that. And I 
want to put my washi tape that I used to decorate in a different place so it doesn't get too bulky on any part of the page. But I'm not really sure where. So I guess we'll see how that goes. And I did film a plan with me last week, but the video was like way too long. Um, I couldn't get it to like flip. It was like kind of a weird layout um, and I couldn't get it to flip in like a normal way that you would watch a video. So that did not work out very well and I had to delete the film or the footage, but hopefully this one works out and it should be shorter. Okay, so Monday is the 25th, Tuesday is the 26th, Wednesday is the 27th, Thursday is the 28th, Friday is the 29th, Saturday is the 30th, and Sunday is the 31st, which is exciting because it's like it perfectly fits in the week and I start my weeks on Monday so it works out. Um, gonna write to do at the top of this other side like I usually do going to have a lot of to-dos to migrate this week. Last week I kind of used my to-dos not only as like the current week but also for if it just came to mind and it's something I wanted to get done this week or next week I kind of just wrote it down instead of like having it in a different place so it's extra a lot of things to migrate. Uh, so that looks good. I'm going to use this like shark slash whale um, or maybe it's all sharks, I'm not really sure. Washi tape because it's Shark Week, which is on like Discovery Channel, which I don't even watch, but I'm not really sure when I'll use this washi otherwise. I like to have like kind of a jagged edge on my washi. Even though it kind of cut off one of them. And it's pretty thick, but I think that'll be fine. Got this in like an order from AliExpress recently. Looks pretty good. And I feel like it's like summery because it has to do with like the ocean, which like is a year round thing, obviously, but feels summery. I'm going to go ahead and lay it down on actually going to draw my lines across here so it's already done and lay down the washi just so I don't end up having to put the washi on the bottom and get that bump that I hate. I don't really measure it, I just kind of like rip it where I feel like hopefully will fit.
Okay, so I like that. I'm going to go ahead and write in my day specific to do's. I am going to force myself to actually use my monthly. Um, Thursday, I have a phone call with my friend. Friday, I work from home. And it's payday. And then I also work on Saturday. I think that looks decent for things that are day specific, except I'll add Thursday is when we need to put out trash, which I literally write every week, but if I didn't, we would definitely forget. Um, and then I have Amazon orders that arrive. I think I'm not going to write that because it's usually not even on that day. So, some of my day specific to do or week specific are laundry, meal plan, groceries, meal prep. Going to the gas station, inbox, declutter, planner pictures, YouTube. And I should have some time to film some more YouTube videos than usual this week, I think. Um, so if you have any requests, definitely let me know. thinking about doing maybe like a memory planner spread in my Hobonichi weekly supplement um, and I could do that on film trying to get into tracking my spending so that's something I want to check in this week oh there's so many to do's these are basically all stuff I need to migrate I might do that later. Don't want this video to be too long. Um, and then I will go ahead and set up Monday just so it's ready. I think I forgot to mention earlier, these stamps, I'm fairly sure you can find them at Hobby Lobby. I might have gotten them at a local or regional grocery store called Meyer. Um, so look out for that. And then I got this, oof, this date stamp um, on Amazon, and I really like it. I kind of almost wish it just had the um, maybe month and date, but it also has the year. So that looks good there. I will go ahead and write in some of the stuff I know is going to be happening tomorrow. So I'll do my AM routine. I have work 8 to 5. 
I'll grab a coffee. I'll go to book club tomorrow. Snack. Lunch. Podcast. Track my water. I just tick it off every day. I don't really put like a actual um, habit tracker anywhere or anything like that. Um, shower. Dinner. Pack lunch. My PM routine. That looks okay for that. And then I'm going to be using... Tombow 451 through the week to like highlight things as I get them complete. Um, I don't really have a lot of darker blue Tombows slash I'm not sure if you'd be able to see like the writing underneath that I highlight so I'll just go with this lighter one that kind of matches. 451. I like to write that down so I can kind of like reference it for later. Um, but yeah so this is my weekly setup for week 30 in my bullet journal. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you like planner content, um, definitely subscribe to my channel. Um, I have a lot of uh, plan with me videos and flip throughs. If you have any um, suggestions of videos you'd like me to film this week or anytime, um, comment below and hit the notification bell if you want to know the next time I post a video because it's not always on the same day. But thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you next time.